breaking news on Truth Connect TV. A day that marks a turning point in the annals of history for Sri Lankans and Buddhists worldwide. In today's 55th session of the United Nations Human Rights Council, Bhikkhu Klepe Aryamaga, a Norwegian Buddhist monk of Sri Lankan origin, unveiled a groundbreaking revelation. He asserted that Dambadiva, the ancient state where Buddha was born and lived, is located within the current borders of Sri Lanka. This challenges the narratives about Buddhism's origin established by the British colonial regime in the 19th century. Bhikkhu Aryamaga's declaration has laid bare a colonial-era distortion of historical records by the British, who systematically obscured the ethnic and religious identities of the Sinhala people. This was achieved by manipulating maps, wrongfully demarking ancient townships in the Indian subcontinent. Consequently, the ancient state of Dambadiva, revered as the Buddha's homeland, was misleadingly attributed to India. However, Bhikkhu Aryamaga's research asserts that Dambadiva's true location lies within the current borders of Sri Lanka. Despite facing systematic rejections in his quest for justice through legal channels in the United Kingdom and Sri Lanka, Bhikkhu Klepe Aryamaga's determination remains unshaken. His exhaustive scientific research now firmly establishes Dambadiva's rightful place within Sri Lanka. Mr. President, Today I bring to light a grievous human rights violation originating from the British colonial era in Asia, starting in 1836. The historic transgression continues to profoundly impact us, posing a threat that presses without proper resolution. Colonial manipulation of historical records and the deliberate alteration of ancient atlases of Indian subcontinent have methodically erased our ethnic and religious identities. As a descendant of the ancient Sinhala race, which is one of the oldest indigenous race of this planet, I personally confront erase of our genuine heritage, the narrative closely labeled us as immigrants within our own lands, resulting from colonial tempering with geographical maps, where Dambadiva, the ancient state, which is also the genuine birthland of the Buddha, was erroneously marked with Indian subcontinent. However, our exhaustive research firmly established Dambadiva Buddha's sacred homeland within the present-day Sri Lanka's border, unequivocally asserting our rightful claim. Despite these clear findings, British colonial fabrication and their enduring legacy through post-colonial narratives precis obliterating our ethnic identity and the genuine lineage of the Buddha. Effort to seek redress through legal channel of Sri Lanka and the UK have been systematically rebuffed, epitomizing ongoing colonial insolence and stark refusal for reconciliation. We, Aryakamma Tana, demand the UNHRC intervene to correct these historical misinterpretations, standing not in supplication but in rightful demand for the rectification of our tranist heritage and ethnic identity. Thank you, Mr. President. In a powerful conclusion, Bhikkhu Aryamaga called upon the UN Human Rights Council not just to acknowledge but to act, demanding the correction of these historical injustices. This claim is not just about reclaiming a tarnished heritage but is seen as essential or global spiritual harmony. Furthermore, the impact of this revelation reaches far beyond the scope of Buddhist history alone. Arya Kamatana's comprehensive research indicates that the geographical location known as Jambudipa in the sacred texts of Buddhism, Jainism, and Hinduism, and referred to as Paradis in the Torah, Christian Bible, and the Quran, corresponds to regions within the Upper Hill area of the contemporary Sri Lanka. This groundbreaking discovery suggests a rediscovery of the primal birthplace of humanity on this planet. The Arya Kamatana organization, established in both Sri Lanka and Norway, is now leading this historic campaign. Their mission transcends ethnic, religious, 
and racial divides, aiming to usher in a new era of spiritual unity. Stay with Truth Connect TV for continued coverage on this unfolding story. Together, we journey towards uncovering the truth and reshaping our collective history.